Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel and uh, another little update concerning the May 2019 update and today we are April 9th 2019. A uh, few questions and also uh, talk about uh, a cumulative update. So in the patch Tuesday updates today the May 2019 update also has a update. It brings the Windows 10 uh, 1903 version to 18362.53. It uh, isn't clear exactly what it contains because the uh, every version of Windows contains a blog post with the security updates and the information. The log for the May 2019 update doesn't say much. What is in there is probably the security updates that were released for other versions of Windows. There's a lot of critical flaws. So they uh, updated with the uh, security updates. And a uh, few bug fixes. I would guess there may be a, a few bug fixes in there at the same time that's being pushed to the May 2019 update. So um, many people um, waiting for this. A lot of people also not waiting necessarily for this. Um, whatever the reason or whatever, if you're winning or not, uh, once again, this is going to be the next version of Windows in the month of May. Uh, this is what I have on my PC right now. If you absolutely want it right now, because uh, I get this request almost five or six times every day, what you need to do is simply go to your Windows Updates and the Settings. And in that Windows Update and the Settings, you will have the Windows Insider Program at the bottom left. And here I will show you. You go here settings go to windows update and security go to windows insider program on the bottom left here what you need to do is click the get started button and start the windows updates uh, for insiders you will choose to be whatever ring you'll choose fast ring slow ring or release preview doesn't matter you will be getting the May 2019 update. Okay, so I'm not going to repeat this because this is I've already already given that information in the past video. It's the last time I'm repeating it. Uh, that's how you are going to get this uh, May 2019 update. To answer the question of yeah, but how do I know that that's the May 2019 update? It is. Okay, it is. We all know it is. It's RTM. It is finished. It's just being tested in the release preview ring now. So that is, and actually Donna Sarkar started calling it the May 2019 update when it was released to the release preview ring yesterday. Just gives you an idea that this is the May 2019 update. As for a performance, a lot of people asking me about performance. Like I said, this version of Windows 10 will probably run better on your machines than previous updates and um, be careful there's a couple of you out there that said well you know starting with this version of windows i started having sluggishness and it was much slower what you are probably experiencing is not that windows itself is slower it's because at some point you received the specter and meltdown firmware upgrade or microcode from uh, intel or from your manufacturer or AMD we know that that update slows down computers from 15 to 30 percent depending on the machine you're using and the older the machine you have the more it shows that it's slowed down so a lot of you are seeing a slower PC on Windows 10 some Windows 10 versions because of the fix the good news is that with Windows 10 May 2019 update you are going to have a faster PC because the red pulling fix that's uh, issued by Google actually is a much better fix. It actually slows down PCs only 5 to 15 percent. That means that your PC will be faster automatically just by getting that update. So it's worth it to move on um, you don't need to move on to the May 2019 update to absolutely get it. 
red pulling fix is being pushed to older versions like the April and the October 2018 update. But the red pulling fix for almost everybody is included in the May 2019 update. Uh, lots of questions about the date. We don't have the date. Official date isn't released yet. It should be around, you know, uh, I would guess around the uh, patch Tuesday of May 2019. So uh, that probably will be the time when this is released. It does contain new features. And of course, uh, with tomorrow and the next for the rest of the week, we'll be, of course, continuing to look at the new features and uh, what's in here. And last but not least, if there's one thing that's cool about what's coming up now, starting with the May 2019 update, is that now finally, future um, feature updates, these big updates like this, are going to be released only um, if you want them. That means there'll be separate updates than the regular cumulative updates every month for Patch Tuesday. And you'll have the uh, choice of installing it or not. The only rule is that after 18 months, when a feature update expires, you will be pushed to the latest version if you don't do anything. But apart from that, you have control of updates. So lots of stuff happening, and I think it's uh, really nice to uh, see this new update coming up. And, um, you know, the march continues for the October 2018 update also. Got a few people that mentioned that they had the October 2018 update show up. So, um, I don't know, it's going to be interesting to see, but we'll have new numbers. And one of the things that I was thinking of with that delay of the May 2019 update is uh, maybe Microsoft is actually kind of looking at the increased, maybe an increased pace of update for the uh, version 1809 or October 2018 update. We'll know only at the end of this month, but it's going to be interesting to see these numbers. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up, and of course, check your updates here on the May 2019 update or 18362. You have a cumulative update that fixes your, the security updates. It actually secures your Windows 10 May 2019 update. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.